Hey guys, the Red Devil's back again, and in this video, we are going to be reacting to Lightwood Stan, reacting to Angelina Jordan, I put a spell on you, for the very first time. I can already tell that this is going to be amazing, and not just because I'm already a huge fan of Lifewood Stan and Angelina Jordan, even though I've only heard a few songs from Angelina Jordan, so I have absolutely no idea what to expect with this one, but I am still feeling very excited with hearing it for the very first time. And just so you all know, I am still thinking about whether or not I should go live and pretty much just do a live stream where I pretty much just explain the difficulties and struggles I go through with having autism and how I cope with being the only person in my entire family who has autism. And while I am still thinking about whether or not I should do the live stream, I am also thinking about whether or not I should start reacting to Angelina Jordan's music myself. And I say that because I really like Life With Stan's reactions to Angelina Jordan's music, and it's been making me wonder what it would be like if I ever started reacting to her music myself. So what do you guys think about that? Do you guys think I should start re reacting to Angelina, Angelina Jordan's music myself or not? And if you haven't seen my previous reaction videos to Lightwood Stan yet, then you'll find them down below in the bio. If you are new to this channel, then please don't forget to leave a like, hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. And j just before we begin, and j just before we begin with reacting to Life Would Stan, I am going to be doing a very quick Try Not To Laugh challenge to Daz Games. Just because I have failed the previous attempts, and I want to at least try and see if I can make it through one of my favourite parts from one of my favourite videos by him without laughing. Even though I know I'm going to laugh, I'm still going to try my hardest. Wish me luck, guys, because I'm going to need it. <laughs> <laughs> what no <laughs> oh. <laughs> I got too much COVID for this. What? <laughs> it was just like <laughs> <laughs> I gotta see it again. It's trying to hold you against your will on your side. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm paying the bill. <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> <laughs> with you right now what to do if someone grabs your wrist from the side. This is something that commonly happens when people are trying to- they, they, they got access to your wrist. You've got an iMac on your fucking wrist. How are they gonna grab you? It's by taking our elbow over the top. Here. So we don't wanna go here and then start over and then find out he's a better fighter than us. Uh, anyone's a better fighter than you. I think my dog, my dog, my dog is a better fighter than you. Here, <laughs> so it puts us in a superior position to control or immobilize the threat if necessary. Yeah, and then he's gonna come back around with his right and clock you, moron. I'll grab you, <laughs> one, two, three. It's very- uh, The way, look, look at the way his arm is actually bending. He would not go down, look. I'll grab you, one, two. See, his arm is just like that. It's not actually like bent back or anything, it, he's just, him going down like that, he's being paid. It's so stupid. I mean, I, trust me, trust me. I ain't an expert, all right? If I was in the special forces, the mission they'd give me is not to eat the Crayolas they put in front of me. I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not sat here like, I know shit. I'm a lover, not a fighter. It's very painful. It's not. It's painful to watch. <laughs> and that's peeling the eyes and striking the throat in the hyoid. That's how you defend yourself from a grab. Is he a T-Rex? <laughs> Why is his arms always up here? Can't he lower them for shit? He's always like this. <laughs> is this his master Wushi stance? Well it <laughs> Well it seems like I failed yet again. <laughs> but anyway <laughs> But anyway, let's begin with reacting to Lightwood Stan, reacting to Angelina Jordan, I put a spell on you for the very first time. 
Hey guys, I got some new music. At least it's new music to me. Okay. You wanna find out what I'm listening to? Come right back after the intro. Okay, I will. <laughs> usual i like it a lot very cool welcome back guys and this <laughs> is life with i love Dan. this and guys we are here again the, with the day of thing. so much yeah, <laughs> How guys i'm super it? super excited for it's today cool. because today i'm gonna be listening to angelina jordan and the song is i put a spell on you all right guys with that being said i need you to sit back relax and watch me React. Yes, that's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, because it's what I always do. <laughs> this again. Oh, <laughs> We've seen this so many times man. before, it will never Somebody get old. Somebody call the exorcist, because there is a 55-year-old black woman in that white girl body. <laughs> okay. I don't really know how to respond man, to that, but man, whatever. Man, man. <laughs> Guys, I was not expecting 
all that. Neith, come Neith out was like, was so oh, cool. <laughs> guys, guys, first of all, I've been seeing her name pop up in the comments frequently. As you put, and I've been, I've been going through comments singing. and I've been picking she other is, people. She is a and I, I just kept seeing it and kept seeing it. And I said, all right, let me let me see what's going on. Because <laughs> this, this, this person keeps popping up a lot. So let me investigate. And I saw the name that was recommended for me. I mean, I saw the name of the song that recommended for me to listen to her. Was I put a spell on you. And, and I do remember that song. Was... And I remember that song Mind being an old song. And I've seen that song before. Yeah. And I love the fact that they paid homage, I think, to the original artist. Because, like, I think she had... I'm trying to remember. Because yeah. it, it was so powerful that mm -hmm. I was paying attention to listening to her. And I kind of forgot some of the scene. But I think she had, like, a candle or something. And it had a picture of a guy on it. Yeah, and I, that, that was the... I think that was the original artist to the song, I think. Y'all yeah. guys let me know in the comments. Mine, mine, I think his name was, like, Screaming Jane or something like that. I can never remember the name of the original, of the original It's because I've heard that song before. I've heard that song every, um, every so Halloween. Of uh, around Halloween covered. time. And then so, somebody was before. recommending the comment. They was like, look, you really need to listen to this one because this girl, this girl is going to blow you away. And so when I and turned it, I, first of all, I didn't realize she was that young because I've never seen or heard her before. And I don't know, maybe this is a long time. Maybe she's like in her 20s now. I don't know how yep. old this is. I know how, uh, how old she is. Uh, she's the same like, age as wow. me. You know, and when she came out, I didn't she I'm older than her. Let go. Like, I was how? like, wow, this little girl like, has a voice. Than Angelina not Jordan. only does she have a voice, how is she? but she than has me. a soul full sound to her she like really i don't does. know why and i'm gonna just go ahead and throw this out here throw this out there but when she started singing for some strange reason i immediately started thinking of janis joplin i see so, what you let me know that down in the comment <laughs> but guys she had a really really soulful voice a very deep down soulful voice mm -hmm. and she yeah. was like singing from within and i felt every note as she was singing and i was just so, so blown so away and did so I. That's, it's exactly amazed what I would that all this big sound was coming out of this little package and i was yeah. like wow mm. that is amazing so this is one of those things where i am absolutely lucky to have come upon this absolutely thrilled that you guys actually recommend this down below in the comments because this one right here literally blew me away like yep. i was she not also blew expecting me this up. and guys that away, being said she, she if she has me more, away. Song, more hits drop those down in the comments because i'm actually going to talk to my wife oh, about this because <laughs> <laughs> okay. she she loves good music and i don't think she's heard of this girl too so i want her to listen to this too um, because this was really, really good, and I really, really it enjoyed was it. Really, it was really Johnny good. Blaze Fire oh, Good, man. There it is. And I really want to know I if knew she he, has he, more. He was gonna so say drop that. some more in the comments for me to react to, because she would definitely be back on the channel with her soulful voice. Man, course, look at that, yeah. man. That girl her voice is always soulful. Her, soulful. Love it. Love it. Love it. Looking forward to hearing more from her in the future, and maybe even seeing more from her in the future, too. Yeah. Guys. Also, if you like what you're seeing and be loving the music and you're loving my reaction and you're Which okay with my to all of those things, <laughs> go ahead and hit that like, like, share, and subscribe yeah. button I've and all, come yep, back here done, tomorrow done that too. when we were doing another reaction video. Who I'm going to be reacting to, I you don't, don't know. know. <laughs> That's up to you guys to drop those comments down below. And another Which, question, guys, just do. to make sure I'm on point, like the, the Screaming Jay or whatever the guy name with the picture... He was the original artist that made the song. Was he? I'm asking. So yeah, I can if, still if he never wasn't remember the original, the artist, the original um, artist. Let me know song. who who was because oh, I, I, I want to make sure I'm right. Because I, I the video that I saw with him was an older video, so I'm assuming that he was the original artist. So I'm not hey, sure. I think been, there's been a couple of people quite, that have done this remember. song too. <laughs> so drop down in the comment because I know I got the most smartest viewers in the world and you guys know so keep me on point mm -hmm. let me know who the original art is i think i know who it is but just keep me yeah. on point I think all right I know guys who with who that being too, with that I being said i'm about to go ahead and get it out of here so sure. guys when you see this little face 
I need you to sit back, relax, and watch me react. With All right, pleasure. Guys, we can I'll always see do you that. on the next video. Bye. Okay. That was hands down, as usual, one of the best videos by Lifewood Stan that I have ever seen in my life. I loved it so much, I am obviously going to be giving it a 10 out of 10 for being absolutely amazing, as well as extremely enjoyable, and also very calming, as well as very powerful, because of how the song made me feel all the way through until the very end, because I was not expecting that at all. And life would stand. If you are watching this, then I really hope you enjoyed this. And if you want to share this, then you're more than welcome to. And I am still waiting very patiently and also hoping that you will react to Home Free's cover of Life is a Highway as well as Pentatonix's cover of Bohemian Rhapsody at some point, as both covers by both a cappella groups are absolutely beautiful. But anyway guys, that is all for this video, I really hope you guys enjoyed me reacting to Life Would Stand, reacting to Angelina Jordan, I put a spell on you for the very first time. Special shout out for this video goes to Life Would Stand, congratulations, I'm gonna go now, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye! And to quote unquote life would stand for, for the next reaction video, I need you to sit back, relax, and watch me react.